Okay, I want to talk about this really quick. Uh, this is upgrade breakpoints. So we snapshotted this off of the Matchroll uh, website here. Basically, in the game, there are effective breakpoints for item power level. The general rule of thumb is you have to be a little careful when you're doing some upgrades. Now, the upgrades really only matter if you're about to break into the next uh, effective range. So we'll talk about the example here, 340 to 459. You can see it says 2.1 to 4.5. So let's say I go to upgrade this item and I go from 455 to 460. It's actually going to go into this range right here and re-roll all of the affixes on the piece of gear. So if, let's say, you had a perfect 4.5% roll and you're at 455 and I roll to 460, it's going to re-roll those affixes and I could quite possibly roll something lower, thus making the roll worse. Now, when you go to actually upgrade at the blacksmith, it will tell you what it projects for it to uh, roll to. So if you're upgrading... You can take a look at this actual screenshot here, but you should be looking at the upgrade result to see whether or not that upgrade is an actual upgrade or not. It can work out in your favor. It could work against you. However, let's say if you're four out of five on your upgrades and your last upgrade is going to push it over this point, chances are you might risk making the upgrade worse. So you have to make sure that you're paying attention to that. Let's say though, in another example, your item is 455 as a base and you have five, all five upgrades available to you. If you go to upgrade it to 460, sure, it's gonna re-roll those affixes into this new range, the 3.2 to 6.0. Chances are over five upgrades, you're gonna actually, even if it was a best case scenario roll at 4.5 in this previous tier, maybe worst case scenario, you roll the lowest uh, affix, which is 3.2. Chances are over five upgrades, you're going to offset the difference and it'll still come out at a net plus and you won't actually make it worse. So this is really just uh, a FYI, a heads up, that when you're upgrading items and it's passing this threshold, to be mindful and looking at those results so you don't actually make your upgrade worse. It's very important to pay attention to because as you start to get your gear up there and maybe you're in this area where you're starting to work on World Tier 4 and you're starting to get through here at 725, you could make some of your gear a little worse until you maybe get into the you know, mid to high 70s or maybe into the 80s where your items that you're finding are maybe mid to high 700s and then you don't have to worry about it too much. Now it does say 725 plus shouldn't be affected, but I swear I've ran into something like this in the low 800s. So I don't know whether or not the data wasn't there or not. But again, if you just are kind of watching for the end result and and looking at the blacksmith and you put it and you slot it there and it says, you know, here we, we can even go to uh, an example right over here, you're just, you just need to look at what the result is. So when you talk to the blacksmith here and you go upgrade and you're going like that, you can see what it is and you can then take a look as the example uh, range just to make sure. So at the end of the day, FYI, make sure you're paying attention to that.